Breathe, breathe. Hands up, chin down. Jab, come on. I'm gonna land that left hand. Breathe, breathe. Don't forget to breathe. Hands up, chins down. Hands up, chins down. And now, ladies and gentlemen, give them a hand, fellas, take a bow. The first day that I that I walked in the in the backyard here and you know I I saw the group of guys and you know first impressions but once I started to get to know the guys and and, and the heart that's around here you know everybody just has a great heart and, and passion for for what happens around here. In the beginning it was I didn't know in the first month or a month and a half who am I fighting and all that. They didn't even know. So once I kinda started to know Travis and uh, throw some punches on each other you kind of like feel bad that you're doing this but you don't want to hurt him but at the same time you want to build your your ability to take the punch and also throw a punch in there and then uh, the first time I took a punch from uh, other uh, fighters here kind of like you know what no I'm gonna start throwing some punches the relationship was great uh, it was again for one purpose you think of boxing and something like a person that's sort of looking at boxing from the outside thinks of like these tough guys that are just wanting to fight everybody right but it's not really the case here I mean every every time I come I feel like I'm in a little bit better shape and stuff right and, and I mean that that first the first training man like two minutes into it I was I was ready to keel over and <laughs> and throw up and stuff right I heard about this uh, this boxing charity thing at um, Ozenham House which is a uh, recovery house for guys who deal with drug addiction. For me, I've always been an athletic sort of guy, right? Yeah, I like fighting, but I couldn't fight because my eyesight was really bad. So for me, training, it's rewarding because I love boxing, but it's also really nice seeing these guys enjoy their training and like doing well. It helps them with their, uh, um, their recovery, right? I know a lot of people, man, that I wish would come to this, right? I actually tell people at the house that I see that I'm walking around with, with sort of anger and stress and I see them just stressed out all the time, I, I tell them like, man, come to boxing, right? That anger you have towards this guy, man, like that will all be gone by the, by the end of the hour. So it's helping the community, putting uh, Kelowna on the map, uh, showing that there's uh, still good people out there that are trying to get some beatings to help some other people, you know? So it's a great thing and uh, helping the kids. Uh, it was fight for the kids number two, so helping the kids in need, uh, the women's shelters and, uh, and uh, men in recovery. So this to me is a way for me to sort of forget for a moment the, the stressors of life. Helps me feel good about myself, right? It helps me see how far I can push myself. That in itself helps me uh, you know, feel feel proud of myself and feel like like I can accomplish something, right? We've seen more and more guys coming in. They come in more regularly, and um, it, it helps them feel fit. And, and that's what we tell them too. Like, if you succeed here, then you can succeed in succeed in uh, in real life as well, right? What I do remember is when I walked in the ring, and I uh, kind of you forget everything, and then now it's the real game. So you cannot go slow. Once you got in and you got a couple of punches in there, I'm like, this beast came out and I'm just gonna give him my best. So it was a really good experience. Well, well, this gives me something to look forward to, right? As the, as the weekend gets closer and I know Monday's coming, right? It, it sort of gives, my, gives me something to, uh, to look forward to out of my week, right? I think everybody needs sort of that, that thing in their life that they go to and they're like, man, I'm so excited to go and, and do this and be a part of this, right? Yeah, every time I watch it, it just kind of bring me that goosebumps and the fight and it was a wild event. I never pictured myself doing something like that. So every time I watch it, it gives me that rush that I feel like sometimes I want to do it again.